What up YouTube, it's your boy Savio, back at it again with another reaction video. Today we will be doing another league video because you guys seem to really enjoy those videos so far. Today we're going to be doing Rise, which I believe was the song for last year's tournament or championship or whatever the case may be. A lot of people recommended it in the comment section of my Giants video. Some people also said that the live version sucked. So I'm going to be reacting to the video itself, the animated version. Uh, League has impressed me at every turn at this point. Uh, their animation even more so than their music, but everything I've heard so far has been good. So I'm excited to get into this one. So we're not gonna take too much time. We're gonna dive right into it. Definitely make sure to stick around to the end though, because you know I'm gonna be doing my little analysis. Alrighty guys, let's get into it. So far in this first section, they have the melody really, really low in the background. Even in the intro, they had it lower, but it seems to be at the same level as it was in the intro with the drums taking a huge precedent. So it's really, it's drums and the singer's vocals just sitting way out front while the melody is way, way back in the back. And the melody sounds pretty good. I'm not sure if they're gonna bring it more to the forefront for the chorus or something later in the song. But in, in this beginning section, it's definitely drum heavy and vocally present. So before whatever is about to happen here happens, if you hear with the drums again, they're now they're really up tempo, they're picking up speed, they're starting to gain energy. I like to call it kinetic force uh, because as you add more and more energy to the drums, it builds anticipation and it builds tension. Um, there might be a drop at some point here because that happens a lot uh, in EDM songs. They build energy either through synths or through the drums and it leads up to a point drop and it's like this huge release uh, and it feels and sounds great and so that's what I'm expecting to happen here but so far again animation whatever whatever Riot's animation team is like they they deserve all the money that they're getting and more because wow just wow <laughs> Um, come on now, look at that, really, that's gorgeous, oh, okay, as far as the song, so we're clearly at the chorus now, and I like what they did there, when they transitioned from the verse into the pre-chorus, they definitely cut out a lot of the little bit of, of melody that we were getting beforehand, and really started to build energy with the bass and the drums, and then as the chorus comes in, boom, you get hit with it. The synth, uh, that sounds like a synth bass, but it might be some preset that I, I don't know of. I wasn't there for the production side of this, obviously. Uh, but it sounds like a synth bass, and that comes in heavy. The singer comes in uh, with those like, like scream chants. Uh, they're kind of like pop rock vocals. You know what? This sounds, this chorus section sounds like the band Imagine Dragons, how they have like that that EDM backing with pop rock vocals on top, and they have like a lot of like 
arena chants in their courses that you know you could see 40 80 100,000 people screaming rise as the course comes in and so I'm confused how this didn't go over well live because this song seems like it was built to crush live Are we killed a boy? There it is again. By the way, this dude is is facing all types of adversity. He's had to climb what two mountains? This is the second fight he'd been in. That uh, uh crossbow with the the finger it's like launching different uh, arrows with each finger. That's dope. I've never I've watched a lot of fantasy stuff before, and I've never seen that before. So um, I need one. But uh, he's running through lava right now. So this dude is is really. He, he coming for the smoke. He want all the smoke. He ready for it. Uh, I think this is like a bridge section. Um, and again, the... The music dies out, and this time, I think he's saying, get along, get along, something. Whatever he's saying, they have, like, all of the highs EQ'd out. So all of the the upper range of what you would hear from the vocals, they, they've stripped all of that off the top, whether with a preset or through just normal EQing, and it gives it that, like, underwater-type feel like if, if you were listening to music through a boombox in a pool uh like literally in a pool and so i'm curious if if they they build on this and over time gradually bring the highs back in and then boom course again or how they transition from from this very like almost mellowed out section to what what is going to probably be the biggest chorus usually the last chorus is the one that really hits you so let's see how they do this it is you right among the dead beneath the dead but do you know it or do you want it and when the giants call okay cuz before whatever happens happens cuz so far the battle has been the best part of this e even better than the music this Video is great. So it's not just his vocals in the back because now I know it's it's a it's a backing track basically or it's background vocals. Those aren't just EQ'd with all the highs out. It's also the melody still. It's the drum. It's it's just so back there. So when he comes in with the cleans over top, you can very very easily hear what he's saying. But again, it sounds like it's the the drums. And the synths in the background are building to something. So I think this next drop is going to be huge. If you want auto smoke. The, the the guy with the Grimrar or the magical book, what I don't know what you guys call it in League, but the guy with the magical book and the glasses, he looked like Mob from Mob Psycho 100. If you've, if you've seen that, if you haven't seen it, go watch it. It's, it's really good. It's by the same mangaka or author who did One Punch Man, which is also really good. But he looked just like Mob when he like closed the book and went like Super Saiyan, his hair like flew up. Yeah, yeah, that was that was pretty dope. Get 
Oh, snap. Oh, man. video oh my god that was so good like oh i i had i had more fun watching that video than i've had watching entire anime or tv shows like that that video was so well animated like, jesus and watching that guy's story you know, he started on the battlefield with all those weapons, and he climbed like eight mountains, ran through a volcano, had to fight a dude in a cornfield. He went through so much to get to the last guy and fight him, the guy who looked like Mob. And as soon as he like was celebrating his victory, you know, finally climbing the mountaintop, becoming, you know, the best, it panned out and you see all of these new competitors coming for his spot and that's that song is inspiring but also the video is inspiring because one it shows that even the people at the top they have a journey you know there is a story to the glory and all the people at the top they have people at the bottom gunning for their spot and as someone who you know used to do athletics is currently pursuing music, YouTube, school, et cetera, et cetera. Like I, I get that because when you're on your way up to the top, like you, you go through battles, you go through hardships. And I, I don't know how anyone can watch that video and not be inspired, not just because it looks absolutely orgasmic, but because of the story that's being told, everyone can relate to wherever you start at some point you're at the bottom in something and you're working your way up working your way up working your way up and you have to fight now you, you don't have to fight to the death hopefully but you have to fight it's a grind to get up every single day and keep going and so for this video to illustrate that i think is super dope um and it goes with the song whose lyrics are rise you know at one point i think it said fight through hell and rise which is intense but yeah like it's that's what it takes to be great you have to continue to go keep going no matter how tough it gets no matter how hard it is you, you can't stop this this is easily easily my favorite video from riot that i've seen as far as like the league videos now personally giants is still my favorite song that i've heard from them they've all been really good um this is definitely my favorite video because the story in it was just so good and it had like four fight scenes come on now like beautiful um but if you disagree i'm sure you guys will you guys have seen a lot more of these than i have let me know in the comment section down below if you have another league video that you want me to react to let me know in the comment section down below as you can see i'm making my way through them i'm having a blast doing them and i'm happy that you guys are liking them as well so definitely make sure to like, comment, and subscribe on the video. Share it so your friends get to see it so the channel can grow. And we'll see you next time, guys. Peace.